All right, folks, I uh, just posted um, a review video just showing uh, me talking with the tank going on, reviewing what I'm using for my tank. Here it is, the full setup in my place. Um, I just wanted you guys to know that uh, what I'm telling you in the video is true. There's the Fluval 306, 29 on a stand, and my two 24-inch T5 high-output fixtures over the 30 gallon aquarium. Now what I wanted to do is break that down for you in kind of a picture. Now here you go. Sorry if it's a little dull, but here's all my products. I save all the boxes for everything that I buy, the tank, the light fixtures. Now let's break this down. As I said before, I'm using two fixtures. These are the exact fixtures that I'm using. The Glow T5 high output, one 24 by two and one 24 by one which means one of the fixtures has two bulbs, the other fixture contains one bulb. They do come separately. I recommend German bulbs, KZ or ATI. The tank is just your average 29 gallon marine land aquarium. Bought it as a kit. There it is. Ordered this online, got a whole lot better deal than I would in any store. My Fluval 306 canister filter. The box for my 200 watt heater. The Oceanic BioCube Protein Skimmer. And for dosing, here is the Bionic two part system calcium and alkalinity. My salt mixture, reef crystals. I'm running my salinity at 1.025 in my tank. I check it daily with a hydrometer. I'm also feeding Garlic Extreme soaking my mysis and brine shrimp in that prior to feeding my fish. My watchman goby really likes it. The green seaweed is for my yellow tang and also my watchman goby. And I also have the Spectrum Thera plus garlic regular formula. I feed that to my clownfish and it is infused with garlic so it's good for their immune system. And here is my coral food, the Fido Feast and Kent Marine Microvert. That's it, guys. That's all I got going on in my tank. Quick shot of everything right there for you guys, if you missed it. And this is, this is what it's done for me. I'm just super excited, guys. You can see my fish are really healthy. My acros are really healthy. Chalices are looking very, very good. My red chalice, my green star polyps starting to take on the back wall there. Here's my little clowns. That frag of yellow acro did come off that colony right there. And for those of you wondering how and what I did to bring that yellow acro back to life, I stated in the previous video the micro snow was not, excuse me, the marine snow was not working for me. So I switched over to Kent Marine's Microvert, and that yellow acro has come back incredibly. I target feed my LPS as well as my SPS. If you guys take a look back at my previous videos, them orange and green zoanthids was originally one polyp, and it has just tripled in size over the last couple months. So success does not take all of the elaborate systems. Granite you could have a much better system. But if you're on a budget like myself, you can make it happen. And here's how I did it. Thanks again for watching, and happy reefing.